Back to the Mushroom Kingdom. Things are different. <laughs> Quite a bit different. I'm gonna see if I can actually talk to the toad. I don't think you can, but you can get into a fight here. All right, here we go. And for some reason we're automatically fully healed. Shysters. Because Super Mario Brothers 2 enemies have been popping up in everything ever since Super Mario All-Stars came out. All right. For this battle, we're just going to take him out the regular old way. And Mario can take him out in one hit, apparently. Mallow, as I'm sure, cannot. Wow. He really can't. Okay, he needs a weapon desperately. There is not one for him here. Uh, it's best just to use Thunderbolt on them for a quick, quick relief. Thanks, Mario. I'll continue to stand watch, but now everyone seems suspicious. By the way, look what I found. Ten coins! I'm shaken, but not stirred. <laughs> Classic James Bond reference. Shout out to Ted Woolsey, the translator at Square who uh, localized this game. Well, it, at least it's text. Uh, he is a renowned translator for revolutionizing how games were brought to English. And he was apparently a James Bond fan because he puts James Bond references multiple times just in this game. But... Honestly, I still feel like this game is pretty stilted. Not compared to games that came before it, but... <laughs> compared to the Japanese version, there's way more cool references where there's just generic, generic text in this version sometimes. But the text in this version is great. Please leave the correct amount of money for the items. Manager. <laughs> At least the shop is still open in these times. We have a nice 132 coins. Excuse me? You wanna what? How can you shop at a time like this? Just take what you want and leave some money behind. <laughs> His presumed wife doesn't have anything unique to say. Neither does that guy. Alright, more shyster battling. Ooh. So, this game was released to uh, critical acclaim, of course. Everybody praised its graphics, especially the music. This is the first video game I've seen where critics were pulling out song titles from the soundtrack to praise on, in the game, which is amazing for 1996 standards. Nobody really cared about the music too much back then, and it just... People's appreciation for it steadily grew, and I think this game is probably in the top 10 game soundtracks of all time. That was too darn close! Thanks for the hand, Mario! Hey! That's the wallet though, Crocodile swiped from me. Can I have it back? I'm scared if you say no, you won't be able to give it back to him, so I'll say sure. Thank you so much. Here, I'll give you this as a reward. Go on now, take it. Flower tab. I will actually save that. <laughs> Nobody's having a good time right now. It's scary outside, so let's play indoors, all right? But I want to play outside. Why do they only have one bed? <laughs> this guy's just pounding on their door. If you're quick. <laughs> this cracks me up. They're just pacing around. Trying to ignore it. Yeah, she's right. I guess we can put it off until things cool down around here. I found the perfect place for a wedding. But now we're all stuck inside. It's like the coronavirus, am I right, folks? All right, last shyster battle I'm going to show. Ooh, three of them this time. You know what that means. We're going to try out our handy dandy thunderbolt. Oh, whoa. I actually messed up the timing on that one. They're pretty easy enemies, all things considered. They go down a one hit to thunderbolt to Mario, and their attack is easy to block. I feel like everything is giving us honey syrup. All right, what was I doing? Oh, I was going to pause to make the cats go away, but they stopped scratching on my door. My wife probably saved us there. Oh, what's going on in the inn? They have no new text for us. But this guy... Was the princess kidnapped by those things outside? Are they a part of this? I mean, Bowser's army has not traditionally had shy guys in it. Except in Yoshi's Island far in the past. See? I'm wide awake! Now I guess it's time for me to win big cash! 
what is he talking about? <laughs> That's actually pretty funny. That's actually pretty funny, as if it wasn't going to be. Oh, wow! She's amazed at his jump ability. So I'm gonna kill him. Hey, a new attack! I guess we will keep this in. Ooh. So you actually can't block most uh, spells that are used on you. I said earlier that you can, you know, there's an action command for everything. Most spells actually you can't. That, I guess I messed up the timing. Oops. And I keep messing up the timing for the hammer too all of a sudden. That's convenient. But, uh, <laughs> praise for this game only grew in retrospect. When it came out on Virtual Console, when it had a huge boom on the internet for some reason. Now I saved you. What do you have to say now? Hey Mario! Look what you're standing in! Jesus Christ. Ha! Gotcha! Now is not the time, lady. Please. Alright, we haven't gone in here. Eek! There are things in our kitchen! Help! Look! Scary things! Get rid of them! It's actually kind of hard to get to talk to the kid. Hope my little brother is okay. No, I want you to look at this background first. <laughs> I love this fighting in the house. Like it even has the doorway in the battle background. Thanks, Mario. But what about my son upstairs? Oops, I forgot all about him. Yeah, see, he has the same text. I'm really worried about my son. <laughs> the dad went up there to save his son, but... I'm scared! Boing, boing, boing! Now this guy can jump! Oh, now I gotta kill him. I thought I was your role model. Really? Thank you so much for everything! Here's a little token of my appreciation. Got a flower tab. Beautiful. You're going to grow up to be just like Mario, you hear? Yeah! I can still jump the highest! You wish. Yeah, <laughs> I love it. Kinda hurts my eyes though. Uh... Oh. Guess we haven't used Thunderbolt as many times as I thought. So I will just keep saving up our flower tabs for a little bit. Well, that is kind of a shitty reward for that whole thing. Thank you, Mario! Thanks for saving my brother. Thanks, Mario. The gratitude is all I need, I guess. Oh, wait. Behind the house. Wait, you don't have anything to say? The invisible NPC. Oh, you have to hit A now. Help the people in the castle and they just might help you. Thanks for the hint. It's just a random hint toad. Now, I will say, there was a rumor about this guy back in the day that he was Luigi. Because Luigi... If you'll notice, hasn't even been mentioned. Yeah, because this is the era where they just think, Ah, oh, Luigi's player too, who cares about him? Though he does show up as the guide in the manual to the game. But a lot of people think this is Luigi for some reason. It's unfounded, but it's nice. <laughs> Alright, well, let's get a move on. Wait for our opening, and here we go. <laughs> uh... Shall we go in here? He needs help! That vault guard! I come here to save him and he runs into the next room! Well, so much for him. Hey, level up! Here we go. Uh, we're already killing everything in one hit. Okay, that's three. Ooh, okay, this is four. That's the one. I uh, guess that increases the power of our fire orb, because I'm pretty sure jump goes with regular physical attack. Now that we have saved you? No. No text. But, we can go back into the vault. This is the only other time you can go back into the vault, and it, no matter whether you went here before or not, you can still get the items. Nice and convenient. They will no longer respawn, at least I don't think. Yeah, they are definitely not infinite. Whoa, he is spinning around. 
Never mind that. Guess what I found? It's a gold coin. A gold coin. And it's all mine. Oh, I found this in the cellar. Here, you can have it. Got a wake-up pin. I guard the vault. No one takes our treasure. <laughs> You're not doing a great job. There's no treasure in there anyway. Oh, duh. It's an equip. All right, we will give this to Mario. Prevents mute and sleep attacks. We haven't seen mute yet. Oh, and it also... I think, yeah, increases our stats. So might as well. I mean, Mario's the more useful member. We don't want to have Mario asleep and Mallow be the leader of the party here. Yeah, okay, you can't talk to him. I kind of want to, yeah, I want to fight that shyster. He's not technically endlessly spawning. Okay, about time. Just kidding, Mario leveled up one battle ago. Uh, to... I can't do math. Four and three. We will go with HP yet again. Mallow has some pretty good HP. Hey, that's the Toad. I didn't realize that's who we were saving. Now that was really scary. Everyone's hiding in the princess's bedroom. I and some others uh, couldn't escape in time. I hope no one got hurt. And I guess he goes to hide as well. Oh, he comes with us. I'm too scared to pass by them. I actually didn't know this happened. Saved by Mario again! How could I ever thank you enough? What? Oh. <laughs> he shimmies on the stairs by the other one. That's hilarious. Another thing this game is lauded for is its humor. Lauded means good, right? That's the good thing. Trapped again! Here we... It doesn't even initiate a battle? Oh, because it's a cutscene. Not so fast, pal. Look at him. Can't even bounce. Hey, maybe we can bounce on his head. Saved by Mario again? How could I ever thank you enough? Yeah. This place gets a little old if you fight all the shysters, because there's literally only shysters. You're in one piece. Thanks to Mario, of course. Saved by Mario again? How could I ever thank you enough? Oh no! The Chancellor's still in the throne room! What? That's terrible! But with Mario around, we're safe, right? I wouldn't be so sure. Yeah, you're right. I'm asking for too much. <laughs> Good luck, Mario. Give him heck! What are those things out there anyway? You may not sleep in the princess's bed. Have you no manners? But she will heal us. And also, you cannot ever get her vibrator again. I'm scared! Wait, I wanna... I wanna jump. There we go. That's a beautiful jump right there. Is this save block always here? This was not here before, right? I find that strange. But anyway, let's go back. They do not respawn, which is nice. Uh, I think this guy will have to take him out. Sorry, I had a brain fart for a second. Oh, why are there so many shysters? <laughs> Nothing but shysters to fight. Come here, please! I want to kill you! I'm sorry, what? Hold up, can I do that again? <laughs> I don't know why I think that's funny. I beat those shysters, I'm just going to heal and save. Spoilers, there's a boss coming up. Okay, here we go! Where do you think everyone went? Well, gang, looks like we have ourselves a new home! We can bounce around all day long, and there's no one here who can stand in our way. Yahoo! Let's bounce the night away! Also, I don't know why they're called shysters and not shy guys. They're just on pogo sticks, right? Alright. There is actually a very neat glitch you can perform. I've never gotten it to work. I tried for about 20 minutes. If you can... Okay. There is... A very specific way you can stand on their head and it not trigger the cutscene that triggers this next boss fight. You see the Chancellor up there in the corner, right? Top right corner? 
of the screen right now, quivering. If you go over to him and talk to him, it thinks that you have beaten the boss. This doesn't, I mean, it affects something, but not really. I'll explain it more in a minute. Uh, you'll lose out on a whole menu option here, but it really doesn't affect the game at all. But I can't get it to work. Let's try it. Nope, didn't work. Not so fast, pal. Look at him. Can't even bounce. Hey, maybe we could bounce on his head. That sounded familiar. Ooh. Listen up, gang. Those guys are gonna... These guys are gonna put a stop to our party. Are we happy about this? You're asking for it. Ooh, you're gonna get it. You picked the wrong people not to bounce with, bub. How about a fat lip to go with that ugly mustache? <laughs> We're just getting jumped. Listen to this song. Alright, I feel like you get the you get the gist of it. I forgot to use our flower tabs before going into the fight. So we actually have a harder fight than we normally would. I feel like we're a bit over leveled anyway, so I'm not gonna complain. And I just realized like two days ago that that spring connecting him to his blade, the, like the knife that he is, is his mouth. That bothers me. That's concerning. Okay, um, no. Actually, how much do we have? We have eight. Mallow's not gonna do any damage. 12 damage. Ooh, Flame Wall! This is one of the few virtual console changes. Uh, its visual effects were toned down greatly out of fear of seizures. Remember, this is one of the final game releases before the Porygon incident, which uh, made people reduce flashing lights being in media. Which is great, because I am not prone to epilepsy, but plenty of people are. So good for them that Nintendo and other developers decided to be cautious. Mainly to avoid lawsuits, I'm sure, but we can pretend it's for good reason. I don't know why I'm so nervous, like, what I'm doing with this fight. <laughs> uh, I could do Fire Orb, but as you can see, he uses Fire Attacks. He's actually resistant to fire orb. All right, that is our last use of jump. So we're gonna do a honey syrup. Oh, if I try to use choose Mario to have it, it just won't work. I find that funny. <laughs> Cause it doesn't matter who drinks it. The FP is gonna be restored to the same people since we share it. All right, Thunderbolt again. If I could actually get the timing right, that'd be great. Did I do it? I did it. Okay, it's right after... What the hell? <laughs> oh, I think I know why. Because he is programmed to do something in just a second. Oh, no. Maybe not yet. No, I messed it up. Damn it. He died? Normally he has this attack where he jumps away. And you have to kill his bodyguards first. They, they do have different stats than the shysters, as far as I'm aware. <laughs> uh, yeah, we can just kill these guys off, no problem. This is an anticlimactic way to end the fight. Normally, he jumps off once, disappears, and you have to deal with the bodyguards, and then he comes back down. It's kind of useless, but it happens. It's neat. I've never seen it not happen. But like I said, you could skip this boss fight anyway. It's the only boss fight in the game that's supposed to be required that you can just skip outright. Yeah, he's gone. A star?
Oh, I'm sorry. I couldn't help but ruin the moment. This is not good. This is not good. The mustachioed one is strong. Strong, yes. We must warn the boss. Come on. We saved the Mushroom Kingdom yet again. Hey, we can actually pause. If you skip the mech fight, the plot will proceed as normal, but you will never get the star pieces option on your menu. <laughs> so you can't look at how many you have in case you forgot. Gracious! Oh, it's you, Mario! What a relief! Nope, not this accent. That's Croco's... That, oh my god. Once again, Mario to the rescue. I can't do his voice anymore. But who were those? Chancellor! Sir! Thank goodness you're alright! Mario, so it was you who got us through all of this. We owe much to you. You already knew that. But, you know, that toad stuff in Peach's bedroom is optional, so... First the princess and now this? It's just too much to bear. Mario! How about we ask my grandpa for help? He knows everything! Excuse me, but who are you? Oh, hello! My name is Mallow. I'm from Tadpole Pond. Well, any friend of Mario's is welcome here in Mushroom Kingdom. So awkward. As I was saying, Mario, you are our only hope! Mario, please! You must rescue the princess now! Mario, I'm in your debt too. Let's head over to Grandpa's place in Tadpole Pond. He can help. Wait, why did I even come to Mushroom Kingdom in the first place? Guess I'll find out soon enough. Could Mac, the sword-like monster who crashed into Mushroom Kingdom, have anything to do with the star piece that Mario found? Our heroes move on towards the Kiro Sewers. <laughs> Doesn't explain what the Kiro Sewers are, but okay. All we can do is wait here. Don't let us down. They all have the same text except Toad. Where could the princess be? We're all counting on you to find her, Mario. Isn't she in Bowser's keep? Hmm. Alright. Uh... I don't think she heals you anymore, but... Are we auto- Yeah, we're automatically healed anyway, so it doesn't matter. I wanna know, is that save block gone? Oh, well, we'll come back later and find out. No, the Chancellor's not waiting on us, dude. Trample the monsters! Smash them all! It'll do you good! Trust me, on this one. What? So I guess Princess Toadstool really was kidnapped by Bowser. You didn't believe me the first time? I bet you have new text. Hey Mario, look what you're standing in! Ha! Gotcha! That was too darn close! Thanks for the hand, Mario. Actually, I don't know what anybody says. Our wishes have come true, so we will be having our wedding in Marymore. We'll be gone for a while. Raz and Rainy. Aw, good for you guys. What's in here, then? I just can't get this meal to look like the picture in my cookbook. Oh, so he's helping cook. That's good. Why is... No, I'm... Chop, chop, chop! I'm gonna cut out the upstairs kid. He doesn't have any new text. Who does? Let's see. Somebody in the inn, maybe? Wait, hold on! This is the highest score! <laughs> if you talk to him during the invasion, he just says, Don't talk to me now. Hey, our buddy's gone! What a shame. Uh, Yeah, okay, I think these guys all say the same thing. I'm pretty sure inside they say the same thing. I'll remain here on the lookout, yeah, yeah. But a lot of people forget to do this, including myself usually, so I'm glad I remember just now. Hey Mallow, what kept you? I was starting to worry. Hey Mist, what do you mean what kept us? The shyster invasion. I got my coin back! Oh, well done, lad! Okay, here's the thing I promised you. There, make sure it doesn't get stolen, eaten, or whatever. Your grandpa needs it, okay? Got a cricket pie. You bet! 
Mario, thank you so much. Grandpa will be delighted. Why is he thanking us? Oh, because we helped him get it back, the coin. Well, 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 we have our first key item. A tasty looking pie. Beautiful. Uh, how are we looking? I just wanted to look at our screen. We have 226 coins. I'm still not gonna buy any accessories. We're good. And let's move on. Now, uh, a lot of guides that came out for the game uh, consider different chapters to exist and they consider them to be the different chunks of the map here like Bowser's Keep is essentially a prologue you don't with Vista Hill and everything you don't have to worry about that but this would be chapter one it's where we got the first star so moving on to chapter two Pond to Pipes as it's called in the Nintendo Power Players Guide I believe it might be the Shogakun Players Guide I'm not sure though Caro Sewers, which we will explore. Oh, uh, well, never mind. There's cutscene first. This is the entrance. Grandpa says to watch out for Balom, well, whoever that is. It's probably a little dark down there, so keep alert. <laughs> we can just leave. Well, we will be exploring it next time. This has been a long one, so I'm going to guess that this is the end of part four. In any case, I will see you next time. I'm LP Master 6. Look at that. We got one star next to our name now. Or next to our level, not our name.